Hey guys, welcome back to the Beard of Bonsai YouTube channel. I am pumped. The day has come to check the status of this air layer we did on this red Japanese maple. It's been at least five to six weeks. So hopefully when we take off the wrap, we'll find some roots and it'll be like getting the best present ever on Christmas morning. And hopefully won't be like getting a lump of coal instead. <laughs> so I can't wait to get in here and see if this worked or not. So let's get to it. Just an early observation. As you can see this branch, all the leaves are still nice and red. Here on the end, it even has a summer flush of growth. So the branch is really healthy. So right off the bat, we at least didn't kill the branch. That's a plus. Now let's get in here and see what's going on. So I'm just going to gently undo our ties. I was so pumped to see this. I really hope it took. All right, so we've got our ties off. I'm going to very gently kind of unwrap it and check out the moss and see if we can find any roots peeking out. Looks like I have one more tie on here. The suspense is killing me. <laughs> The moss is still moist, so that's a good sign. Let's see what we've got here. Let's have a look. Do we have any roots? Well, looks like we got the lump of coal. <laughs> so, <clears throat> it's not successful. I would say it's not successful yet. It's starting to form a large callus, and a lot of times that will happen before it grows roots. So, let me grab my phone set up here and give you a closer look. All right, so this should be set up so you guys can see. So right here, you can see this ring. Stop this from falling off here. You can see this ring where this callus is forming. It's kind of swelling up, and you can see these little bumps here. I do believe that those bumps are going to become roots. I think that's the very start of roots. It is possible that it is just a callus. But I, I'm thinking that that is the start of roots. So I'm just going to gently wrap this guy back up. We want this on here nice and tight. That is a key to air layers, just getting them on there good and tight. Oops, about knocked the camera over here. Let me focus back. This is real 
amateur hour work going on here. <laughs> I'm going to have to fire this camera, man. All right, there we go. Hopefully my hands aren't blocking this. Although this part is not anything too exciting, so I'm going to pull that tight. Give it a twist. Put that on there. Let's do the same. Up at the top. Pull this tight. Give it a twist. And do one in the middle. I just like to do a little extra there just to make sure it doesn't fall off or come undone. And there you go. Now it's back on. So it's September 1st. So I don't know if we're going to be successful at this this season. We're just going to leave this on here and see what happens. All right, guys. So there you have it. There's our air layer update. You found out as I found out. I was super excited to get in there and see some roots and be able to cut that guy off. But we're just going to have to wait a little bit. Like I said, the branch is still good and healthy. So worst case scenario. We'll try again next spring, but we're going to leave this on here and just see what happens. And that is the best way to learn is just to experiment. So that's what we're going to do. That's it for now. Just a quick update. Thanks for tuning in. Come back later. We'll check this again and see what happens. If you haven't done so by now, subscribe so you stay up to date with all my latest videos. We're really going to try to make this channel grow, have some fun. I'll learn from you. You'll learn from me, hopefully. And together we'll become better gardeners. Until next time, take care.